One of them, actually both of them would make a dense grade. And all dense means is that your average, over the average length of the timber, you got six lines per inch or more. Whereas this one right here, I mean, this one's probably out of a tree that probably a couple hundred years old, yeah. probably a four or five hundred year old tree. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Most of this timber, with the exception of these two pieces, was a salvage cut down in the Calmeopsis wilderness. This is my reference base, correct? Yeah. You know, I'm coming over an inch, then I'm coming over an inch and a half, so marking one, two and a half. And then I'm going to, this is where I'm actually going to draw the, the actual tenon in the other direction. So that, because this is a, this actually exists in the tenon. We can't draw it out on this face or this face yet because we need to cut that material away. Let's try and wrap this up in the next half hour here to get all these things laid out so we can start cutting them. This length is going to be slightly different. Okay. You want to start slow and start, and you're over here because this is your critical line down here. If you get off up here, it's not that this is the reference corner? No, because this is the visible line. Oh. Maybe just a little bit of water. Make it shiny all the way to the top. We have to square it up. So in order to square it up, you can pull diagonals. And your diagonals should be equal. So that's... That's 12 foot 2. Um, you think you already got it? Do it a different way. Don't get scared. 
Two more. Not tight, right? But it's bearing. Yeah. Yeah. It's moving. All right. I'll come off the ladders. All right. That's as much as I'm gonna go. Let's bring the ladders over to the other side and repeat the process. All right. Okay. Okay, yeah. Can someone brace the ladder? Yeah. It's a bomb. Don't, uh, get on the Lift up on it, buddy. There you go. What's your hand on? I'm taught. Like when you crank it. What am I looking for? It's tight. Yeah, you can do it. Rain bit. If you'd like to drive a pig, though, make sure you get a chance to drive a pig. Essentially, you know, six by six beams. 